Okay, here we are, Matthew Russell Lee, Inner City Press, here in New York State Court, uh, where Daryl Campbell, uh, a.k.a. Tackstone, was just sentenced to 35 years of upstate incarceration. This was for the murder, oh, manslaughter, the death of Ronald McFadder, three of whose family members spoke at the sentencing, and also the injuring of Troy Avenue, Troy Ave, and two others. Uh, at the end, after the legal arguments were done, after it was determined that there would be consecutive sentences, after Judge Klott said that he wanted them to be consecutive to show that four victims, additional time upstate, um, Daryl Campbell spoke and he said it was all Troy Ave's fault, that Troy Ave attacks anyone that attacks his music, that he's a jokester, that he only took a gun to, into the club in Irving Plaza to, to protect himself, that he always has felt that, that he would be attacked, therefore he had to have a gun. Um, there were people sitting on both sides of the audience. There were supporters of Taxstone on one side, and there were the supporters of, mostly of Mr. McFadder on the other side. Um, I was in the middle. Uh, and I have to say, 35 years is a long period of time. We're going to continue to follow it. There was reference made to the federal case, which is uh, pending before Judge Schofield. It's a felon in possession case. He did plead to that, and the prosecution said he only pled to that because of the potential larger uh, uh, exposure uh, in federal court for not pleading out. We're going to follow that as well. Will that be on top of the 35 years? In any event, here we are, uh, innercitypress.com, you'll find it online as we continue.